what's up my party people welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video we are doing all things discount grocery shopping i am very excited we are starting out today's video at none other than the grocery outlet i freaking love the grocery outlet we are gonna go in check out what deals i got going on today if you're new here welcome my name is becky please make sure you give this video a big old thumbs up so i know that you enjoyed it it really helps me out it helps out the algorithm and without further ado let's go find some discount groceries recently got this yellow bag from trader joe's my favorite color is yellow and i was super excited that, to see that they had that color bag and also check out my yellow notebook right now is her favorite color yellow or is her favorite color yellow you let me know I laugh so hard at the fact that I had two exactly the same color yellow things. I did not realize it until I got to the car. So I love a grocery outlet. Discount shopping is my favorite thing in the entire world. The only thing that sinks right now is we don't have a deep freezer, which you guys know if you've been watching my channel for a while is my number one complaint. <laughs> it's such a first world problem, but I watch all these ladies with like, they're like women across the room, like how Kim was. I don't know if you guys watch her YouTube channel, but she always talks about that. Like that is a lady or a person or anyone with a deep freezer or a second fridge and freezer. I'm like, oh, okay, life goals right there. One day we'll have space for a deep freezer, but for now we do what we got. We just walked out of the grocery outlet and I spent a whopping $44.19. I'll give you guys a big collective haul of all the things we get today when we get back. Um, I got one of these little like Hillshire farm snacks. They're two for a dollar. So I grabbed two, obviously four dollar to have to hold me over while I'm out today. Cause one thing I always struggle with when I'm out grocery shopping is I always get like dizzy. All right, I am sitting outside of Food City. And our goal in here is to look for markdowns specifically. Um, hopefully bread some markdown bagels would be like so awesome are those chicken drumsticks that you're seeing right there i totally would have bought them but i just spent a bunch of money at the grocery outlet so i had to spread my dollar on this trip okay i found a small amount of success at food city just now i had to exercise my eyeballs like frugal fit mom like style like because at this food city um instead of having all their discounted breads in carts they just like sticker them along the bread wall that's been not the case at any other food city i've ever gone to so i wonder if that's going to be a thing they move into and at first i only saw hamburger and hot dog buns and if you watch my last grocery or not grocery haul but my last freezer pantry clean out I made a promise to you guys and I made you promise me that you would knock the hamburger buns out of my hands if I was tempted to buy them because I hate buying bread at full price now because of how many times I've gotten it for such a good deal. And so I was like looking at the hamburger buns and I was like, okay, if I bought them and I ate them for sandwiches, maybe I would use them. And then I saw some sliders and I was like, okay, I may be more likely to use the sliders for sandwich for sandwiches or whatever and then i spotted it the one loaf of bread that was discounted i finally found it i like looked and looked and looked and probably circled that bread aisle like three or four times before i found it our last stop today is aldi um so i guess i'll take you guys along with me there and then when we get home we'll do all the things uh grocery haul itch so <laughs> grocery haulage that was so hard to say All right, my friends, I am home from the grocery stores, my little discount grocery shopping adventure. If you enjoy grocery hauls, make sure you give this video a thumbs up because we are about to jump right into this haul. And let me tell you, it's a good one. I'm also about to crack myself open a Celsius in true Becky fashion. I've been out like all day, so this is much needed. Oh my gosh, it's gonna power me up to do my haul. Okay, <laughs> I have crammed every single food item onto my counter here. And let me tell you, I am so excited about this haul because I spent $66.43 on every single thing that you are looking at right now in this moment. All right, I tried to organize things, but quickly learned, but organizing things by store was not gonna happen. So we're just gonna move left to right. Um, okay. 
So I got a, a little under a six pound container of drumsticks. These are great for us. They are cost effective. They're delicious. They're versatile. Um, if you are on a tight budget and you want chicken in your life, thighs and drumsticks are going to be your best bet. They're on sale for 99 cents a pound. Drumsticks at the grocery outlet are always 99 cents a pound. So always a great still there. Also, I found this little pork loin at Food City for only $3.60, which that is a great price. I'm assuming it was marked down and then marked down again because it just sat there. So um, I'm going to throw this in the freezer for a quick, easy um, dinner option for us. I also um, got this pizza crust. Um, I like making like quick, easy pizzas and things, especially when Garrett is gone. I thought this was a great deal for those. They were a dollar cheaper than the crescent rolls, which I originally was gonna get, and then I saw the crust, so I grabbed those. This cream cheese and this yogurt down here, I was so excited to find at the grocery outlet today. So they have a two pack in here, strawberry and regular. I love both of those. I'm gonna freeze the strawberry because originally I was gonna do it in the opposite order, but they didn't have blueberry bagels at, the, at Aldi today, so I'm gonna freeze strawberry use the regular and then swap it and then try to find blueberry bagels eventually. Also this blueberry yogurt, speaking of blueberries, uh, was on sale for $1 for this huge thing of yogurt. So of course I grabbed that. At Aldi, these apples were $1.99 for this huge bag. Um, baby carrots for us this week. Bagels to go with the aforementioned cream cheese. The piece of little resistance of the bread that I found today for only 50 cents. Heck yeah, it was the only one left of sandwich bread and I did not buy the hamburger buns and that is where we consider ourselves winners because now that I have found a way to buy discounted bread, I hate doing it. Bagels, I'll make an exception for because I have yet to find a bagel discounted near me. Like people show them in videos all the time. Not where I live, I don't know. Maybe people where I live love bagels. All right, also I got some creamer at aldi because we i always need creamer uh this enchilada sauce is actually really good and it's been on sale at my grocery outlet for three for a dollar for so long so i just ran out the other day so i grabbed three more two things of corn the green beans these aren't the french style but it's fine these are on sale for 39 cents a can so i got four honestly if i had more room and more room in my budget i would have gotten more than that because that is a screaming good deal for canned veggies the medium salsas were a dollar each so i got two as well as this can of diced tomatoes it was also a dollar so i grabbed that um if you guys have been watching my hauls for a while you know i love getting my um lunch meat at the grocery outlet so I grabbed this guy for super cheap today the celery I got from the grocery outlet today um Garrett really has been in need of some jelly and he we both prefer my granny's like strawberry preserves but we haven't been able to get that for a while so grabbed this this no sugar added peanut butter is still on sale for $2.49 there so I'll be buying it until um they no longer have it because that's such a good price for that big of peanut butter. Also, this spicy wing seasoning packet, I thought that would be fun even tonight to try it. Veggie stock, I got this last time and they still had some, so I grabbed it again. It's a dollar for both containers, so I grabbed both containers of that. Milk from Aldi, three bags of broccoli from the grocery outlet, a dollar each. Four for a dollar tortillas. We have one package left. We go through tortillas quite quickly here. Um, these are both from Aldi. I just got one of each because we have quite a bit left from my last haul that I did. Onions, I cook with onions every single night. And I got two of these from the grocery outlet today because I was feeling a little peckish and I knew I was gonna be out for a while. And they were two for a dollar. So I grabbed one to eat now, one to have when I'm in a hurry eventually in the future. Butter, I try to get butter every single time I go grocery shopping. I sometimes I don't prioritize it, but today I was able to. And then I got, I restocked us on like this type of meat. I got two of the ground turkeys. They're running very low, so I think that's probably the last time they'll have it there. Um, but it's only $1.99 for a roll of ground turkey, which is an amazing freaking deal. Also, same price here for the Italian sausage. These were the last two in the store, so I grabbed both. 
And then these were there today, and these are some of my absolute favorite things to add into any recipe. So I grabbed two. Less than 70 bucks for all of the stuff that you were looking at is an amazing, amazing price for everything. All right, so now it is time for me to put all of those groceries away. I thank you guys so much for clicking on this video, watching this far. I so, so appreciate you. I will be scanning all of my receipts on Fetch, Ibotta, and Receipt Hog to get points back for shopping today. If you don't have any of those, I will link them down below as always for you guys to check out yourself. With all that being said, thanks for watching and hanging out with me today while I went and got some discount groceries. I'll see you guys in my next video super soon. Bye.